Shot fired! Shot fired! My partner's been shot. It's an urgent call from police officer Ryan Davis. The partner who's been shot is his dog, Jethro. The dog was shot four times after responding to a break-in at this market in Canton, Ohio. Shot fired! He shot my dog! The German Shepherd fought bravely to stay alive, but after 32 hours, died from his wounds. I'd trade places with him in a heartbeat. Jethro's funeral was a major event fit for a hero, a full police funeral on what would have been his third birthday. Officers and their canine partners from around the country came to pay their respects. The bond between Jethro and Officer Davis is understandable when you consider the fact that Jethro joined the Davis family when he was just eight weeks old as a family pet. But when he turned a year and a half, he started training to become Officer Davis's canine partner. Jethro grew to be a wonderful and loyal comrade. Getting killed in the line of duty, saving his master's life, is something Davis still can't get over. Good boy. But life must go on, and now Davis has started the difficult task of finding a new partner. He was introduced to more than a dozen dogs at the Canine for Cops Foundation in Houston and put them through a series of tests. Among the finalists, Tuco, the German Shepherd, whose skill at apprehending bad guys sure impressed Davis. Hardworking, friendly, loving. Next comes Joker, the Belgian Malinois, who's really high-spirited. He's just a, a big, big old baby. There's Senzo, another Belgian Malinois, especially good at tracking. Oh boy! Finally, he makes his decision. It's Tuco. For me, the bond was there. Davis oh says boy. he's looking forward to oh a boy. new partner, even though he knows Jethro can never be replaced. I think he's capable of being the rock star that everybody hopes him to be.